Hello, hello, welcome to the video. Most of you might have been waiting for uh, it's about the evolutions. So uh, I found out that you can evolve Basculin uh, into Basculin Legion with uh, doing recall damage. So doesn't move. Moves that damage, uh, best collision in the process, like I'm doing here. And uh, you need to take about 300 damage, I think. Uh, and then, yeah, well, you can just evolve it that way, but you can do anything between uh, the thing. So you make sure that you don't die, and uh, you can heal, you can grab things out of trees I believe but you can also use other attacks so yeah be mindful that you do this in a very secure location like this uh, starting field actually with the chings and Bidoof and, and the stardies Because you need to kill them, else you take damage, and this way you can like micromanage your heal better as well. So, uh, for the other evolutions, um, like crawl it into Arcanine, it's just using a Firestone that will suffice. Um, for the Hishuan Electro Jute to evolve into uh, Voltorb, you need a Leaf Stone, which I forgot that this is a Crest type now, so that's why you have to use Leaf Stone. Uh, evolving Sneasler, well, see, uh, Sneasel into Sneasler, you'll need a Sharp Claw, I believe it's called. Uh, I can check actually. It's this. It's the Razor Claw. Uh, so you can see, I can use that now because it's daytime, and at nighttime you can just evolve the regular form of Sneasel into Weavile, which was also the missing Pokemon that I couldn't figure out last time because I never saw like Weasel. So then evolving our saloon. Uh, Ursa Ring into Ursa Luna. Uh, that is going to involve using the other new item that I did know. It's this, the Peat Block. And uh, you can use it on Ursa Ring, but only during a full moon's night. So that's another night evolution. So, yeah. Uh, be aware of that. Maybe do it. Uh, in the same quests, uh, like when you did the Clefairy mission, if you haven't already did that, that's a great opportunity to mix those together. And that's it actually, but I will try to finish this best collision and, and show you how you can manipulate the world around you to actually just going to bed and then waking up until it's full moon's night uh, so I think I'm going to be close at a uh, at the volume bus collision here Did it have to run away, really? I could very well use the mount to run around as well, but oh well. So, as you can see, I 
can evolve past Kalita now. So that's because of the recoil damage. I brought him down to about uh, 18 MP HP before. So uh, yeah, let's evolve him. Let's see the mighty first new Pokemon. Legion. And then we'll do the rest while we're waiting. Let's growl it into Arcanine. Now for me personally the evolved Pokemon are all going to be new, so that's going to be a big completion for my Pokedex. Uh, so as you can see, just use a leaf stone on this guy to evolve. Ta da! New Voltorb. Oh well, it was Voltorb into Electro Dude. <laughs> I messed that up. Oh well. You know me by now. Going to evolve the Sneasel because it's the alpha version. Okay. So, yeah. Thought that was me to show you. And as you can see, uh, he's just slender. It has nothing to do with the basket. The basket is just to carry you around. So. If you wondered if it would have a uh, basket, well, now you know, it doesn't. So, I'll show these guys off at uh, our basket legion right here. Our Arc 9. Like we do. And then, uh, we have. Sneezler as well. I do keep in mind that this Sneezler is the alpha form. Uh, yeah, it is. So, evolving these two, uh, well, they need to evolve at night. So, except for Ursa, Ursa Ring, because she. Needs like full moon to evolve. So I am going to try and make it nighttime, see if it's a full moon or not. I have slept a few times, so I should be close or, well, at least closer to a full moon. Let's see now. So that means it's not a full moon, and you can evolve Sneasel at night uh, using the Razor Claw as well. Just pick the female for this. Ta -da, there you go. There's your Weevil. I'm going to skip a few nights. Uh, just to see. If I can get Ursaluna to evolve. Mm -hmm. 
And I actually don't know what the moon stance is right now. Uh. Can I check it on the map anywhere? It sounds like it's night time, but I don't think that's meaning that it's I don't think that I can change it accordingly to the moon stances, so yeah. Oh well. It's gonna require some sleep. I was worried there for a second because <laughs> the light came in. And if you're worried that it doesn't work, well, you just saw the weather patterns change here. So that's meaning that it does work. And you just have to. Be a bit patient, I guess. Now I'm worried that I... Can we actually... Hmm. This is interesting. I don't actually know if... Uh, If a moon pops up here on this part of the map, Oh well, it's a full moon. I didn't see the full moon, but apparently it is because there's a ring can evolve into our Saluna now. There he is, my big boy. My big alpha boy as well. Here he is. Yeah, I know. Oh well, there's the moon just rising over the hill. So if you're not sure then yeah, well it works as you saw. And I can confirm that it's a full moon, so that's good as well. So I'm going to leave you guys to this. Uh, I know I've been checking this a lot, but uh, I will check it once more, and then uh, I'll see what I can do. I've got 14 Pokemon. Oh yeah, the outbreak of uh, the Bibberol as well. I did an outbreak before this, but uh, oh well. you can see how that went. I will be returning to the village, professor, good sir. And I believe uh, that I only have a few Pokemon left now, actually, to 
I mean that's what the and I was wrong on, on some of, of these Pokemon. Um, like that's Arceus, I know that for sure now. Mm. These two are locked in a space-time distortions in the mountain area as well with Shield on and Bastion. So those are uh, the only Pokemon that are locked to that, I think. Uh, Magnemite is as well, I believe. So that's the Weavile that uh, goes here. Uh, then... Ishim, so I should just go and catch one. Uh, it should fix that. Alakid, uh, I've seen Alakids running around in uh, the snowy parts. So yeah, that's gonna be completed. Uh, Magmi, Magbi is a um, a rare spawn at the Firespit Island, actually. So I could go and check that a few times. Uh, we do have the Basque Legion now. Uh, Primplop. I thought this was locked as well. No, it isn't. It's just right there. It says at the bo at the top. It's at the spring pad. So I could evolve a Primplop now and get that sorted out. And then I was worried about this little guy as well. But yeah, again, it's just catchable. It's in the Dorning Meadow. So this full line can be completed. There is also a special alpha uh, full of lotion of this guy. Uh, out in the wild as well, so that's not going to be uh, any problem at all to find. Just uh, some of those. Well, actually, the Pokémon that are locked to the space-time distortions are uh, going to be troublesome. Ah well, let's include. Uh, let's include our. Primplop evolution and so on uh, into this episode as well. I don't know if you guys seen this, but you actually have to come and buy uh, items uh, from this nice man here, the Wandering Traders, and then he will set up the items in your house and you can change your Rotoms uh, form that way. He's still not selling me anything, and I told you the reason in another video, but I don't know if that video ever came out, or it was like corrupted or something. But basically, yeah, you have to go and catch 20 Pokemon and then come back and then he is restocked on those. Uh, Weavile, my friend, you can come and... Well, actually, you can go inside the color box because you're a color variation now. Uh, Sneasler. I would put Sneasler in here as well, but it's an alpha. It is, right? Yeah, it is. Uh, as well as Ursulona is an alpha. Uh, so there's that. These I'm just keeping around to evolve at a later time. Uh, Arcanine is just a regular end stage, uh, best collision as well, and so is Electrojude, but first I need to get out my Pokemon. Uh, thank you, thank you. I do still need to evolve this Luxio. Uh, but that's just a normal evolution, that has nothing to do with a special team. And Chingling as well, I believe. Ah, that might actually require a stone or something. I will go and check that right now. Uh, so... Oh, I... 
I didn't know see I needed a print up here as well. Where is print up? There you're hiding. I see you. If it actually can evolve. <laughs> no, it can. It's too weak. Ah, oh, poor boy. Well, the rig can evolve. I just straight normal evolution line. We'll complete some other Pokemon as well. So here we have Grovel, and then Grovel can evolve into. Hey, Tortera. Uh, with Cyndaquil, I'm going to keep Cyndaquil around for a bit. Uh, I was just worried about those others because, uh, well, various reasons actually. Uh, now I do need to evolve you. How does one evolve a jingling? I don't know. <laughs> Might be just uh, Might be just an attack that it needs to know actually. I'm not sure that it needs to know. Um Oh, it knows the extra sensory. I will teach you. Uh, confusion. Yes, okay. That didn't seem to do anything at all. Might be just as well that it's uh, a friendship evolution. I'm going to take out all my evolution items just to be sure that it isn't one of these. Uh, nope. Nah, it wasn't necessary to check all the other items. Because they're not for this Pokemon. So yeah, uh, actually I can go and catch uh, a Shimshou, I believe, so that's not gonna be... any difficult uh, to do, so yeah. Just leave you in here, uh, Primplop, I will evolve you, my buddy friend. Uh, let's see all I had, but how oh well I'll evolve him as well. And who else? Uh, can I take with me? I can take uh, this in a quill just because he is a good boy. For the rest, I don't know actually. Uh, I'm going to take a uh, Riolo with me. Might as well take Psyduck with me. And Psyduck might actually be able to evolve right away. If I don't have another Psyduck, that is of course. Uh, nope, don't see one here. And I don't see one there. 
so if it can evolve then it's great uh nope it can't so i had the cynical line uh, so not gonna evolve him right now so i'll be training these uh as well with Priplop. and then yeah it will be just an episode with uh the other evolutions as well so yeah uh i'm gonna leave you do this um here's our Haley again ah uh -huh. cute girl So, Pokedex is almost completed now. Um, well, completed. I've all, almost seen them all uh, as a, a better, a better reference. So yeah. The reason why Cobalt Coastlands is like uh, 94 seen and 94 caught is I believe because there's still some Pokemon out there that I haven't seen and they're hiding inside those you know those big things those spaces origins uh yeah Hellbuster Islands uh still need two there we have seen that Corona Highlands too as well and we know where those are, so yeah. Oh well, I'll leave you to it. Bye bye, guys. Thanks for watching once more.